it is basically a tension deficit which stands for the ad bit and hyperactivity disorder so it has two elements to it attention deficit and hyperactivity disorder so if i have to expand on it to ye represent karti hai patterns of behavior which usually appear in childhood to neurodevelopmental disorder hai ye bachpan se shuru hota hai recognize ho ya na ho aksar parents and teachers will notice that the child is usually either overactive which is the hyperactivity bit can do impulsive things yani ki wo spur of the moment mein cheeze karta hai without thinking टीचर्स ये बताते हैं वाले को कि कौन बच्चा कॉन्सेंट्रेट नहीं कर सकता फॉर एनी लेंथ ऑफ टाइम एंड ऑल्सो दैट ही डज नॉट गेट ऑन विद अदर पीपल एंड दैट ही लैग्स बिहाइंड एट वर्क और एट स्कूल एंड एकेडमिकली वो उसका डिक्लाइन रहता है सो वट हैपन एज द टाइम गोज ऑन फनली इनफ इट टेंस टू गेट बेटर एज पीपल गेट ओल्डर but clearly we know that uh, it can continue in adult life aksar ye dekhte hain ki overactivity ka jo element hai na wo kam ho jata hai lekin impulsivity inability to concentrate risk taking ye cheeze worse ho jati hai iska nuksan ye hai ki it makes it harder to work to learn and to get on with other people and it's not surprising that adults with ADHD are more likely than to experience other mental health problems like depression anxiety uh, feeling low inki self esteem kam ho jati hai and more often than not they can actually enter into taking substances and then can get hooked on to it so how is drug correlated with adhd drug misuse ka correlation bada strong hai because people tend to get they tend to become overwhelmed they are struggling in their day to day life they are struggling in their social contacts they are struggling at work to ye phir apne aap ko self treat karte hain and they can then enter into experimenting with drugs and then sometimes they get stuck into it you know.